Well, we had another beautiful day today. It was a great day to be outdoors. Tomorrow promises the same kind of thing. So this is pretty nice. This is pretty good stuff. We are seeing warmer than normal conditions out there with plenty of sunshine. We'll show you what we had today for our daytime high, 78 degrees. And normally we're at 74. So we are going to continue to see warmer than normal temperatures. But because we're going to see some drier air mixed in with it, it's going to feel very comfortable beginning tomorrow. 63 was our overnight low last night. Tonight we'll get closer into the 50s for the overnight low period. This is normal for us this time of the year, 55 and 74 degrees. But tonight we're going to get down to about 58 degrees. We're at 69 right now. The humidity is at 87 percent. The winds are coming in out of the west at around five miles per hour and we do have fair skies out there. We had a cold front that was moving on down the state and that frontal system has produced nothing but mostly sunny skies for us today and brought in, drawn down, some drier air as well. Most of the showers that we did see were so light they were very barely discernible on radar and right now we are looking at those clear skies. You can see how dry it is all across the state of Florida and this has been drawn in by a high pressure system across the southeast and that's helped to push that cold front all the way through. So for the next couple of days we're going to see some pretty nice weather and then beginning on Sunday night you can see here's where the frontal system is going to start to stall out just a little bit. We're going to see some rain showers associated with it there and then those those clouds start to come back on up, but we are expecting to see fair skies for the most part over the next couple of days, and we're really not putting rain in our forecast for several more days. Another cold front will be coming in, and that's the one that could bring us some more wet, wet weather. We've got this at the front right here, moving on down the state of Florida. High pressure will be moving out into the Atlantic, helping to force in that drier air, and we are going to see some showers, but they're being brought in by a low pressure system moving across Texas and helping to bring in and stir up some wet weather across the Gulf Coast states. But the state of Florida is going to be pretty great with that. Frontal system passes on through and then we get that drier air coming on in and you are going to feel the effect of it all tomorrow with a beautiful, beautiful day on tap. It'll be a great day to get out to the beach. The winds are going to be a little stronger coming in out of the northeast. 15 knots, seas 2 to 3 feet, 77 degrees at the beaches. Tonight we get down to 58 degrees, mostly clear skies, so cooler than last night. And then tomorrow we're back up to 78 degrees, very, very comfortable, some breezy conditions as well. And we keep those warmer than normal temperatures with us all the way through Thursday.